Hi, my name is Brandy Matthews. I teach science and PLTW Biomedical Science at Caverna High School in Southern Kentucky. I joined the STEM program through GREC when they came to our school looking for people to enroll in the program. Hello, my name is Kristen Anderson and I'm a math teacher at Cumberland County High School. A lot of times before I was just like, okay, I know what I'm teaching, I know how to do this, and uh, this has actually enabled me to bounce ideas off, um, branch other, other subjects into my math class. Hi, this is the science department from Butler County High School. My name is Jennifer Davis. I teach chemistry here. My name is Emily McAfee and I teach biology. My name is Madison State and I teach environmental science, forensics, and anatomy and physiology. And then my name is Pamela Spurgeon and I teach in science. Hi, uh, my name is Matt Sheffield and I'm just here to talk a little bit about the STEM program. I think a lot of it has allowed me to actually branch out and see what other districts are doing, what other teachers are doing in their classes, and then also take some of their ideas, tweak it and make them my own and emulate some things that they do. Um, and just to see how it, how it works with our kids um, because every district is different and I think that's the glory of all of it. I've been able to share things with our English teachers, our social studies teachers. The biggest part of it, um, I think, is the, the support system that I've been given. Um, I, I've met a lot of new teachers uh, through this grant, and we have um, some very awesome um, people that are over this grant that are always there willing to help us. And uh, Firstly, how has STEM affected my professional growth as a teacher? Uh, number one, it is completely changed my perspective on teaching. I'll say, I mean, I've been teaching 18 years, so I've been to a lot of different professional developments. And often when they're chosen for you, you know, they may not be the most effective. And something I can take straight back to my classroom. But the ones that we've had so far have been all something that I could, I could pull something with and take back and actually use. And I think also um, for improving STEM education, uh, I think something that all STEM educators struggle with at some point is wanting to be able to provide um, uh, learning experiences for their students, but sometimes the funding or the um, just resources are not available to them at their school district, and that's been really great to work with um, the STEM CS grant um, to have those uh, capabilities. They'll listen to what your needs and what your wants with your students. Professional development has been great. This summer we spent quite a bit of time at GREC um, learning how to look at data. So now, myself and three other teachers at my building, we're in this program. We have become our school's data team. I'm pretty stoked about that. So I would say it's greatly enhanced my professional development. How is the STEM grant geared toward students? I think the STEM grant is an excellent program to broaden the horizons of the teacher's perspective as to what goes into teaching science or mathematics and how they all go together. I would say it's personally benefited me in that I had no formal training in anatomy and physiology, but I was asked to teach an anatomy class next semester. So through identifying that need, I worked with Dale and Terry to uh, be able to participate in the anatomy and clay online professional development. I received resources that I can use in my classroom and I'm super excited about it. So the support system that I have gotten um, through this grant is, is, is great and, and it's been one of the biggest benefits uh, that I can see through and I'm very thankful for that. that the Endeavor courses that we are a part of, these have provided a lot of resources that um, have helped us be able to create um, different lessons and things of that nature to bridge more of these STEM aspects in our classroom. This course has really shown a, um, how you can integrate STEM into your classes and it doesn't have to be that you have a degree in some STEM field. 
I already am pretty familiar with that because of Bioman that I teach, Project Lead the Way. It's project based and we use a lot of data, a lot of computer equipment, and we do a lot of graphing and analyzing data. But I'm glad that this is showing other teachers that don't get a chance to use this, that it's really beneficial and it's authentic and the kids truly um, grasp onto something when they realize that it's the real world. This provided us some content area that we've not been able to be exposed to. We've had engineering, we've had coding, we've had astronomy, you know, multiple different areas that we didn't necessarily get to study before. And I just think it makes what we offer our students so much better. you to kind of open your mind think about it for a minute and you know this is something that is new it's something that will help you grow as a new teacher especially and it's an avenue to help you gain a support team who's out there to work for you so overall it's not just another program for anybody that's considering this entire program jump in jump in um, if you were chosen um, by your district and principals to do this um, just jump into it uh, I am I actually have a rank one and um, almost a doctorate I, I didn't need a rank change I didn't need anything extra but the things that I have learned about how to present information and present material to students has been great and finally if you are considering joining the stem program through Greg I highly recommend it Dale and Terry and Dale especially will guide you through the process. They will be there whenever you need them. Um, I have learned so many things already from Dale and Terry and this group and I've made a lot of good friends and a lot of connections with people that can help me out in the classroom and I honestly am getting a wealth of information from my online classes that I can go to now when I know I need to pull some authentic data. I know exactly the places to go and what to do to incorporate that into my lessons.